Shut up and sit down. Photography AC. AC on photography for students and children in English. Photography was invented about a century ago. In those early days, only simple box cameras were available to take simple black and white pictures. Photographic techniques and equipments have come a long way since then. Exploding flash guns have progressed to compact electronic flash units, box cameras to sophisticated computerized reflex cameras, stills to movies, black and white to full glorious colors and part-time dabblers to highly paid professionals. On a summer day in 1827, Joseph Nesifor Nippis made the first photographic image with a camera obscura. Before Nips, people just used the camera obscura for viewing or drawing purposes, not for making photographs. Joseph Nesifor Nispis heliographs or sun prints as they were called were the prototypes for the modern photograph by letting light draw the picture. In almost every sphere of human activities nowadays, photography has now come to play a very significant role. Photography as a hobby is perhaps the most popular of all its uses. Cameras and films are now cheap and easy to use. Instamatic cameras have largely eliminated the hit or miss techniques of yesteryears. The use of camera phones has made life so easy and entertaining. It has vast usage and is one of the best modern age techniques so far. Anybody with a pair of eyes and hands can take reasonably good pictures. We see amateur photographers all over the place especially in holiday resorts and recreational areas. Tourists and sightseers are never without cameras. Pictures and snapshots of important events, wonderful times and places or memories, to be precise, are all recorded in photographs. They are our link to the past. Newspapers and magazines would never be what they are today without photography. Photographs enlive in these periodicals with pictures of people and places. A picture is worth a thousand words. So goes the old saying. A well-clicked photograph is worth more than a thousand words. It describes a scene infinitely better than mere words can depict. Besides making newspapers and magazines attractive, Photography provides jobs to numerous professionals who roam around the world in search of pictures. Eyes work more than ears is a widespread fact. The use of photographs helps people to retain better. Photographs, images get quickly captured in our mind and stay in our memory for a relatively long time. That's why it is also said that many people have photographic memory wherein whatever they see gets stored in their mind and helps in remembering things quicker and in a better way. This proven fact has been rightly harnessed by the educationists wherein they use more and more pictures in textbooks and while teaching. Modern printing processes make extensive use of photographic techniques. Offset printing and photocopying are examples of what photography is doing for us. Such is the versatility of photography. All the books and magazines are now made by photographic processes. In another field of human activity, that is medicine, photography is extensively used. X-ray photography is now a common thing in hospitals. They help doctors in the diagnosis of disease. In addition, X-rays can be used in the treatment of certain diseases. Nowadays, with the invention of fiber optics where light can be directed through thin tubes, doctors can see and probe into the insides of patients as never before. They can then photograph all they see in full color. Such techniques were unheard of just a decade or so ago.